Crash Internet's Catman Beard. Back with some more KOTOR 2. We finally found some freaking honestly pretty sweet armor. It seems like it's got some kind of dynamic lighting going on. Oh, automated fire extinguisher. So we are going to switch weapons and just regular attack it. Well, once I get in like a line of sight. Come on, man. There we go. Oh, oh, hold on. Switch weapons. Oh, fire suppression droid, that's one we do want to fight. Put on, yeah, mining shield. Can do like, uh, I forget which is which. Valor, I guess. Man, I probably should have picked up Stun Droid, huh? Sometimes it just, like, neutral automatic attacks, sometimes it doesn't. It's sort of weird like that. Actually... It's not going anywhere, so let's take some aim. Take your aim, take your time, tight boys, take your time. Okay, and that's it. Do you have anything on you? Nope. Okay. Whoa. This guy over there, I don't know if it saw me, but I'm gonna head over here. So, yeah, let's do that to try to get a good hit on it. Oh, it's shielded. Oh, that's fine. Keep them guessing. Keep them guessing. Sonic Detonator. No one has mines. Like, nobody has freaking mines in here. Gidon Beacon. Got another Lux Rock Contraband today. Security and started doing spot checks. And a quarter jet, so my cash in the lower bunk in the room in the eastern door in order to be safe. You won't even know it was there unless you know to look for it. 
Worked the camera around again, asking if I had any special cargo to sell, but I was getting a bad feeling about how he was asking, so I stayed quiet about my stash. Gonna keep that blaster smuggled from Telos and a few grenades there just in case things get rough. Only benefit to having a room in the farthest from the doors it should buy me enough time to dump the contraband security does do a surprise inspection. Okay. Scattered survival kit, okay. More chemicals. Wow, is that Wow, you can see that dude's ribs. It's kind of fucked up. Reflex package. Okay. There's Corta. How long needs to be plugged in? Mining laser, a lot of good stuff on these guys. Uh, I'm not gonna listen to his log yet. Let's do that instead. Dremel amplifier. Advanced mining laser, yeah, those suck. Okay. So I think if I plug that in, then it advances the plot. Alright, some more chemicals. It's as if they want me to have enough chemicals to make something. A breath mask, cool. So then I'm going to go around to fixing the ventilation systems. The food processors back up again next time the fumes start flooding the mess hall. I'll be dead rather than just nauseous. Keep the breath mask here in this case we have a repeat incident. Hey, maybe we'll put that on. This kind of looks like a lunch line. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's actually what this is supposed to be. Sneeze guard and everything. Immune to poison. Use the lab station now. I can make a med pack, antidote kit. I can make a retinal combat implant. Why not? What do you mean? Oh, I just need one more chemical. Okay, breakdown. What can I break down? Oh, a sonic grenade gives you that much? All these that I never use? Let's break all these down. Deadly Sonic Mine. Okay, so I've had two this entire time. Okay. Alright, it's like a main one. So sure, let's make get a couple of those. There we go. That's pretty good. D D D D. Reflex package. Okay, yeah, let's do that. It never hurts to save. Can never save enough. So before I go over there and advance the plot, I wanna 
Yeah, you can't bash doors. I do want to run back over here and try to find that guy's stash. We was talking about before we proceed. Uh, he said it was the East Dormitory. It's one of the bunks. I believe. Okay, can I do that? I guess I don't have, because I don't have any demolition skill, I just can't even try. Didn't say, I seem to remember it being this way. There's another door that if I had any demolitions whatsoever, I could plant a mine in it and blow it up. Eh, let's see. Maybe it'll have a place. Okay, maybe there's not like a persistent like log no messages. Okay. Effects, combat, feedback, dialogue. Uh, so weird that I can't just call back up that data pad I looked at. Oh, here we, oh, here we go. Let's see. Da, 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 da. Any spot checks? Lower bunk and room Eastern dormitory. Okay, is this so? This is the Western Dormitory. All right. Why is there a giant hole in the floor in the middle of the dormitory? Who knows? The farthest room in the Eastern Dormitory holds the secret cache. Highest room, tallest tower, yada yada, Shrek reference. But you bet his room is behind that door that I can't get through because I don't have any demolitions. Alright, fine. So, it just goes to show that my plan. Well, I'm not saying this is a bad build, because it isn't. There's no such thing as a bad build. Uh, what I will say is that as soon as I get the opportunity to make those skills... Next time I get... like It, it pays to have at least one in a skill. Access to cameras... Almost didn't make it out of the dormitory section before the lockdown, you murklack. You're cutting a little close, Why is this a camera, though? Yes. A regrettable miscalculation on my part. I'm contacting you because I'm picking up a subspace transmission from within that level. Is that your doing? No, they, they must be trying to use the old relay system to send an emergency signal. I doubt they know what's really going on. Hey, this turbo lift's locked down. Mm-hmm. Oh, they won't be leaving the dormitories. Oh, the whoops. explosion within the tunnel has damaged the ventilation systems, causing breaches in the core exhaust conduit. I thought it was stuck. That's going to kill them all! Not all of them, but I'm sending a number of mining droids to your location right now to correct that problem. Korda, this turbo lift's locked down. The sequence isn't working. Keep trying it! You! Why are you doing this? Why me? You. It was never about you. The Jedi is all that interests me. Hmm. But then you had to ruin everything by revealing his identity, and then trying to harm him. And that I cannot allow. 
Statement, you are a risk quarter. You are impulsive, yeah, 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 crude, yeah, yeah, yeah. and soon deceased. Fucking query. Corta, Corta, are you dead yet? And again. What statement. I believe I forgot to mention that I reversed the Turbolift codes. Mm. In case you managed to get this far. Okay, there we go. That's it in reverse. Why reverse and not randomize? Good freaking question. Almost didn't make it. Yeah. Hey, try the code again. Oh, they won't be leaving the dormitory. What? I didn't mean to do it again. I thought something else would happen. But enjoy the unskippable accidental cutscene where the holograms fall, where the bodies aren't exactly. Corta, Corta, are you dead yet? Smug statement. I believe I forgot to mention that I reversed the turbolift codes in case you managed to get this far. Oh, HK, you bastard. Okay. Skills. Now see, I only have three skill points, which is very frustrating. So if I do like one point in security, that's going to leave me one point left over. So with, with that, I can at least do like basic shit. Sure. And always a good idea to save. You can never save enough. Emergency lockdown. Oh, are we going to have a full party soon? I felt a disturbance. Our enemy is here. We must leave at once. Enemy. The one that fired upon the Ebon Hawk as we attempted to rescue you. And he will not let us go without blood being shed. So who? The story is a long one, and time is short. Come, we must go, and quickly. All right, let's go. We need to make our way to the docking area on this level. I fear the airlock has already opened, and if so, we must be on our guard. If we cannot reach the Ebon Hawk, then we must find a way to escape on the ship that is docked here. All right. Eh. Oh, I don't have anything for her to use, do I? Well, some stuff. Have a reflex package, have a... A Rakatan band. Sure. 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 Eh. Sure. And sure. And auto level up is fine. <laughs> All right, we have increased our numbers, so that's great. Hmm. Eh. Let's go get Attaboy and then get going. Things will be a lot better when you have more party members. Oh, man.
You saw that right, Korea? There's guys over here. Fight me, cowardly dickwads. Okay, I guess not. Oh, emergency. Yeah, I don't need to hack the emergency hatch. Mm -hmm. What in space is going on? Who's this? Another Jedi? Uh huh. What did you guys suddenly start breeding when I wasn't looking? Yes. This is my girlfriend. Is that a problem? <laughs> uh, all right. I'm guessing that Republic ship that just docked isn't carrying friends of yours. Negative. I hope your talent for understatement is offset by your skill with a blaster. If not, then I fear our time together will be short indeed. Yeah, and I'm also good at running and drinking, Your Majesty. Mm. And even if you two aren't big friends of the Republic, that warship's the only way off this station. And has joined the party. As long as he isn't the last party member standing, he can't be knocked out. Nice. Good thing we have a clear run to the ship. Threat. Master, perhaps I did not enunciate clearly the last time we spoke. I suggested that you should shut down, stay put, and wait for rescue. No, you were clear. I just don't listen to assassin droids. Well, actually, after all the ter death you caused, rescue is hardly the term I would use. Correction. I am not here to argue semantics, Master, so I will simply inform you that you are wrong, as were those recently corrected miners. Are you the one who killed all the miners in the medical bay? Answer. Master, the miners intended to place you in jeopardy. Uh -huh. I could not allow that to take place, so I was forced to negotiate a termination of hostilities. After reprogramming the mining droids to mine any organics they perceived, they began to kill the miners one by one. Nice. A series of flawlessly timed explosions drove the miners into their dormitories where I was able to gas them all at once without wasting time hunting them through the mining tunnels. I then administered a large dose of sedatives to the remaining miners in the med bay, enough to kill them, but ensure you slept peacefully. Of course, against my calculations, you awaken from your tank prematurely. I am ashamed <laughs> by the inconvenience that caused for both of us. And so you ordered the mining droids to kill me, too. Answer? You misunderstand me, Master. Those droids were there to guard you. As I said, I did not anticipate you awakening from the tank. You are quite a hardy specimen for a Jedi. A wrong toe among humans, <laughs> if you will indulge me the metaphor. Besides, as you proved, Master, such droids could never pose a threat to a Jedi. The droids were custodial in nature, cleaning the facility of other distractions. Why did you want to capture me? Answer. It is beyond the scope of my programming to probe the motivations of my clients, Master. Suffice to say that I am being well compensated for my services. You have been a difficult target to find. You have been wandering the galaxy since the end of the Mandalorian Wars, leaving little record of your passage. It is as if you did not wish to be found mm -hmm. by hunters such as myself, or more likely, the Jedi Order. Well, yeah, those guys are dicks. So who's your client? Chiding answer. My programming renders me incapable of revealing the identity of my client, Master. Too bad. However, I am free to say that my client is wealthy and very interested in possessing the last of the Jedi. All right, enough of this. You won't take me without a fight. Resignation. Very well, Master. If inflicting pain is the only means to resolve this matter, then you leave me no choice. Uh, 
one thing at a time here, guys. Put me on range. Hold up. Auto level. Uh, sure have that. Uh, have that. Have that. Sure have that. Well, no. Have that. Yeah, have that. Because you're probably a stealth guy. This one's better. Sure, have that as a backup. Okay, now. Uh. Uh, no. Yes, use it. Okay. Alright, so Atten, you actually should stay on the blasting. And, uh... Because of that, let me take a regular one. Atten, you can have the blaster. Okay. No, damn it. Self-sustaining unit HK vocabulator advanced mining laser. Okay, wonderful. Now I can give myself back the thing I just gave to Adden so generously. Uh, actually, let's give that to Kriya instead. Oh, well, she can't use it, so never freaking mind. Alright, uh, well he was trying to block us, I guess from going up here? I'm not sure where we're going, to be completely honest. So let's take us a wee break, and uh, we will advance the plot in the next episode. So this has been KOTOR 2, Captain Mintbeard. Appreciate each and every one of you who watches. So wash your hands, wear your mask, stay safe, stay healthy. Thank you so much, and peace out.